when you plant a tree, whether that be in the city or the country, you know it's going to take decades to see the benefit fully realized, but you do it because you want it there for the next generation, especially on a farm. We have a lot of century farms up here in this area. And, you know, when you see somebody in their 50s and 60s going out and putting out evergreens, they're doing it, what one, to build, you know, a wind block for their farm, but they're also doing it because they see the value of it, even if they don't fully realize it during their lifetime. And taking care of the ground is something that we should do, even though we don't fully realize God never promises me tomorrow. I don't know, you know, but I do it because I care about who's going to be taking it over in the next generation. It's a blessing to be able to farm up here. And so we do whatever we can so that the next generation isn't trying to fix what maybe we unintentionally made a mess of. And with manure, it is a great natural resource. I mean, it is made by pigs. It has the benefits of the chemicals that you would buy at your co-op, but it can be reused. It's reusable. And so by putting it in the ground and, and knowing exactly how much through testing, you know, that manure and through using GPS testing in a field and finding out where our deficiencies are for our nutrients, we can increase or decrease the amount we put and right in the strip, right where we're going to need it, you know, worked in well, so it's not too hot. (laughs) We can do that and be good stewards of not just our ground, but our hog operation. It is your, like you said earlier, a full circle for us. 